And uh, before I wrap up, we've got some news coming in on the never-ending uh, Domilevo saga, if you like. Um, the latest is that the audit service is asking him to pay handing over notes. He has a copy of the letter which says, uh, we, we refer to the letter from the office of the president regarding your retirement and request you to prepare a comprehensive handing over of the audit service to Johnson Ikuamwa, a CEDU who has been asked to continue to act as Auditor General until the President appoints a substantive Auditor General. We'll be grateful if you could complete the exercise within two weeks of receipt of this letter. So the Audit Service Board asking uh, Daniel Domelevo to hand over notes in two weeks. He's got a response from them, uh, for them, and that's that on your screen. It says, this refers to your letter dated 16th March 2021 on the above matter that is handing over of administration of audit service. Your request for a handing over note is preposterous to me because I've been out of office for more than eight months. Furthermore, one, paragraph two of the letter from the office of the president dated 29 June 2020, requested that I hand over all matters relating to the office of the Auditor General to Johnson Ikoamwa, a CEDU who has been in charge since the 1st of July 2020. The letter from the secretary to the president referred to in one above delivered to me after 4 p.m. on June 29, 2020, requested that I started the leave on the 1st of July 2020, contrary to Section 27 of the Labor Act. The section provides that at least 30 days notice shall be given to the worker prior to the commencement of the leave. Number three, the short and unlawful notice from the presidency notwithstanding, I prepared a handing over note and added over to the acting uh, handed over to the acting auditor general on the 30th of june 2020 and he has been in charge for over eight months number four when i resumed work on the 3rd of march 2021 johnson ekuma isidu did not hand over to me with the excuse that the handing over note was not ready and finally after 9 p.m of the 3rd of march 2021 the day i resumed work i received a letter from the secretary to the president requesting that i proceed on retirement all of the above notwithstanding, if you so wish, please direct, it, direct the acting Auditor General to hand over to me, and I will thereafter hand over to him. And so that's the latest there. Uh, Daniel Domelebo's response to the Audit Service Board. We see what comes out of that. That's it for business. Post is coming up next.